Hulu Bulu! Today it is December. Oh my god, unless you're watching this a lot later, in which case it might not be. But anyway, for me it's December and oh my god, we're so happy, we're so excited. It's gonna be Christmas. I don't know if you celebrate Christmas. If you don't, then you know, you gotta be excited too, just because I don't know. Just be happy if you can. <laughs> At least try to. But here we are, we're gonna make some Christmas hats. And I got this idea to just, to just do it. <laughs> um, we, I don't know, I had this idea of having these really small, tiny Christmas hats you could put right on top of your head. Um, but, you know, I don't think it turned out quite right because we chose to do it in pastel colors, or I chose to. Because I thought, oh my god, that's so cute, that's so on brand, whatever. But it actually ends up looking a little more like a party hat rather than an actual Christmas hat. But it's whatever, I like it. I'm glad we we did it. It was a lot of fun, even though it was very hard to sew through all of this and all those layers. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm sewing the inner lining first. As you can see, the white part, and then I'm gonna sew the outer part, and then I'm going to sew it together, and... Yeah, we made the little piece on top out of some pom-pom, out of yarn. I don't know, I just got the idea that that would probably be pretty good. I've actually made small Christmas hat, hats before for my, um, my pets in the past. And it's really cute, I think. I really enjoy it. Or... I don't so much enjoy sewing it, but I enjoy what it looks like on, on top of a teeny hits. <laughs> it's so cute. And my sister is trying to cheat her way through this, making it easier and simpler. And um, she ends up not being able to fold it right, and she actually has to start over, or you know, something like that. So yeah, too bad for her. <laughs> I don't feel bad for her, but it's too bad for her. Anyways, if you're very observant, you might have noticed that we missed a day. Oh my gosh, we missed a day. We're supposed to upload Monday, Thursday and Saturday, you know, from December. So we actually missed the 1st of December uploading. And, you know, we had some personal troubles and I just decided for my own mental health and for my well-being, I would skip a day just to feel better about everything, about myself, whatever, everything like that. So that's why we missed the day, but from, from today and onwards, all through December, it's three days a week. As I said, Monday, Thursday and Saturday. And if you want to watch, if you want to join us, if you want me to keep you company, which I would love to, you can subscribe to our videos. I mean, I don't want to say click the notification bell, I have never, I mean, I've been on YouTube for 10 years or more and I have never clicked that bell. I don't see the difference it makes. But if you want to, you can click it, but you don't have to. Like, don't, don't do it just because I say so. Anyway, this is quite a long video and I thought to myself, let's talk about Christmas stuff. And as you see, I am from... I'm from another country. I'm not from... well, I don't... I can't say another country because you might be from the same country but, you know, I'm not from England or USA or anything like that. I'm... I'm from a teeny tiny country in the, in the, in the northern region of Europe. <laughs> anyway, um, so we celebrate Christmas quite differently. Um, we don't celebrate the 25th at all. It's like it's Christmas Day, so sometimes we eat lunch, but that's about it. Um, other than that, we just, yeah, we just celebrate break <laughs> Christmas on the 24th. And, you know, we have these different uh, things. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so good at, at telling you guys this. We have, um, I don't know, we call it Advent or Elvent. That's how we say it. And that's literally every Sunday. From... Uh, 
from four, four Sundays before Christmas. We have where we light a candle each Sunday to, you know, make things good. <laughs> uh, I don't know, just to count down to Christmas. I'm sorry I got distracted. I could suddenly hear the upstairs neighbors, even though I'm like, I'm gonna record early so they're not home and then they're home anyway. Ugh, sorry. I'm not gonna complain anymore. Uh, it's just, yeah. Yeah, but we just had that yesterday. It was Sunday, so we celebrated by making Ebleskiwa, which is like a pancake mix that's round. I think someone, I mean, I, it kind of went viral a couple of years ago. And we had Glück, which is, you know, it's usually fermented wine with, um, with almonds and raisins in it. But we made our own version without alcohol. Um, just out of some apple juice and some different stuff and uh, we also made a bunch of those uh, you know my mom made the apple skewer and <laughs> and look and then I uh, helped with the the different doughs cake doughs it's, it kind of sounds like I'm saying doughs like uh, you know the flying birds I'm not I'm trying to say dough <laughs> I can't say it right, I hope you know what I mean, but like we made for um I'm gonna I'm gonna just translate the names or maybe I'm just gonna say them in, in Danish. Yeah we're Danish, oh my gosh, I spoiled it, I'm sorry. I said where we're from, oh no. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we made um Brunkea and Vanillekranze and Kleiner. Which are just different kinds of cake and we love to cook and make stuff for Christmas. I mean, everyone loves food at Christmas, but how many people love cooking? Only a few. <laughs> it's often not a lot of people who help. We celebrate Christmas, just the three of us. We have for many years, because, well, we don't have a big family. So that's that. We are just the three of us, and of course, my bunnies. But they don't really celebrate Christmas. <laughs> no, no, no wonder. I feel like I'm, I'm getting really bad at this um, again. Maybe it's because I took a break and I'm like, oh my god, I can't speak for 12 minutes. But yes, of course I can. Of, co of course I can. It's not 12, it's 13, but whatever. I'm, uh, that was almost like a music song starting to play all the that, 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 that. <laughs> anyway yeah so that's how we we celebrate part of it we also have like a candle that's like a countdown for Christmas so it has you know the numbers 1 to 24 and you burn you burn the number every day and we've had that since we were kids and ours is super crooked I don't understand why I, d I just don't, I don't know why. Um, I think it's because we've had it for a year and it's been inside this closet that is super hot most of the time. Like extremely hot. So I actually think it sort of melted the candle to have this weird shape, but it's okay. You know, it just makes it unique. You don't always have to look for errors. You can just accept that things are not always perfect and that's okay you know because we couldn't find another kettle <laughs> so we didn't really have any time to replace it or anything and you know people here just usually um, decorate on different times like some days um, or some days some years or some people what am I trying to say I'm getting distracted by all the sounds I really hope you can't hear them um, you know, some, some humans decide to decorate before Christmas, which I don't do. Um, some do it on December 1st, and some here do it on the first event, which, I mean, it really depends on what time of year it is, because, um, well, like this year it was actually the the 2nd of December, so 
many people probably decorated the first, but we, we haven't really decorated yet, we just have put a little bit up here and there. As you can see, I wanted to match the pom-pom on top and I wanted to make it more Christmas-like. So it wasn't so much of a, a party hat, so I wanted to braid this yarn and make it like, yeah, around the hat, put it around the hat, like that. <laughs> I wish I could be like, you know, this is Christmas. We have so much cool stuff planned for you. I really think you should subscribe. I think you would enjoy it. I know I'm sign sounding kind of off, you know, I'm like constantly sick. I actually got seven hours of sleep last night or, or more actually, kind of seven and a half or something like that. And I haven't gotten that in weeks. And you think I might be kidding, but I'm not, I haven't. Um, so that's really nice. Still I'm feeling sort of iffy and, and a little bit sick, maybe. But it's okay, it's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Do you have any Christmas traditions? I would love to hear them, actually, you know. Comment them down below. Or if you don't want to, then don't. I'm not gonna make you do anything you don't want to do. <laughs> um, but I would really, I, I think it's so interesting to hear how different people celebrate Christmas. Or if you don't celebrate Christmas, like, what do you do around this time where where so many people do? Or, like, do you celebrate something different? Let me hear about it. Let me hear all about it. I would love to know. And I would love to know everything. This Christmas hat is... It's so Christmassy or not. <laughs> it's cute. It's so cute. Look at that. <laughs> I'm going back to the whole look at that kind of um, vibe. <laughs> it's no good. Um, but I think I'm almost done with the hat actually. So yeah. Uh, the rest of December is gonna be super cool. I hope you will tune in and watch with us. We enjoy doing this and yeah, I hope everyone will too. I hope you like the new intro too, by the way, and outro. Um, takes a long time to make these intro outros, but I think it's worth it. And oh my god, the camera would not focus. I don't know what happened, it just would not focus. But this is what it looks like all the way around. Look at that, look at how cute it is. And here we are just posing and the snow is dazzling or maybe it's not, but that's what I'm trying to signalize. <laughs> that's all for now. Have a very happy holiday. Bye!